All right, everyone. Let's do the No, hooray! We're back, and we're excited, and we're thrilled, and we are happy. We aren't miserable at all, nor are we depressed or bored. Wow, what a great episode, guys. Aren't you ready for episode yeah. two of the Disney Star Wars series show, Ahsoka, by Dave Filoni? Because I am. Boy, oh boy, am I. Uh, while I was Ooh, pissing, bean. I was thinking about the last episode we watched. I'm and... so sorry to hear that. Oh, no, it's fine. It went well. If they wanted to have Sabine get hurt or nearly mortally wounded, they could have constructed it in a way where she didn't have to be an idiot all on her own away from the city and gets, you know, attacked, right? They could have had her and Ahsoka on the ship get attacked by the Sith and still got all the outcomes that they wanted, right? There's no reason to split them up narratively. I mean, it hurts to show because it makes her seem like a moron and Ahsoka a moron for letting it happen and everyone else also morons for allowing it to happen. I don't know why they make some of these decisions when they can get all the outcomes they want narratively without having all the characters necessarily be complete and total idiots. So the first episode was pretty great and we're looking to see how the events unfold further. Uh, why would we have any more preamble than that? We we're excited to see what the show has to offer us next. Is everyone ready? Mm -hmm. yeah. um, yes, I am so ready. Uh, uh, Previously on uh, Star Wars. Okay. You know who can help you with this? I'm not sure she'll want to help. You know who can help you with this? Probably hundreds and thousands of people across <laughs> the galaxy. Just give it to someone who likes puzzles, I guess. Yeah, and also we're probably going to keep <laughs> oh, this somewhere please. safe. A child could have solved that in their spare time. Also, I hope that Sabine gets a big chewing out for, you know... Fucking everything up? Yeah. Like, the hugely fucking everything up? Because mm -hmm. you handed me alone, because you can't just think in a room like normal people. What's funny to consider, by the way, is this show, much like many shows of this era, have to just lead into the sequels. That's their job. <laughs> I mean, the robot missing her twice like that? Like, you had one fucking job, robot. Oh, uh, look at that wound. Out the back as well, like... Out Wait, that's back, hitting yeah. several important things. Liver, lung, yeah. like... Oof. Remember when, um, stupid sniper lady, she got shot in the belly and then they brought it back and she had a mechanical stomach. Yeah. Mechanical that's another stomach. Person. That's another Somehow person the survived. mechanical stomach Panic. is more reasonable than just nothing. This isn't just... Oh, you're not dead yet. In hospital. <laughs> Sabine. Sabine, wake up. We're in a white room. It, wow, it's white. I've, it's... I was just at a hospital yesterday. They, they've got color and things. No. The droids. They took the Matalox. How are you alive? I unlocked it. There were two galaxies, and then a pathway appeared between them. A pathway? Well, it's not. It's just a Man, line. You, you seem like remarkably okay for someone who yeah. just had a massive hole put in their chest. You were just chilling. That was like hell? that was like hours You're ago. Okay. You're okay. Fine. That was yeah. hours ago. Yeah, that was last night. That was like that this was shit like is missing line. in your stomach right now. Okay, like, wait. Yes, the droids there. destroyed it, but not really. They didn't destroy the hard drives. How many droids were there? Two. I took one out. Ahsoka, get some rest. Wait. Also, you fucked up hugely, bigly, hugely. The fact that she's able to, like, sit know. up yeah. when she's got a giant hole in her chest. You need my help. No. You've done enough. There you go. She chewed her out. She's yeah, done like, enough. Yeah, like, you're missing, you're missing all of the, like, the you from that the hole. The fleshy bits that there. You have, like, a out. cylinder that's gone. No, I think yeah. Star Wars assumes there's just water inside us, and then you <laughs> refill it. Dave Filoni thinks that human beings operate under hit points. Oh, no, it's red yeah. evil trees. This look place looks pretty evil. evil. Oh, look, Ooh, this, this is evil. Star Wars Stonehenge. This is Starhenge. Starhenge would be the name, I guess. Yeah, beautiful. Stenge. Warhenge. Make sure to take all the time in the world to show it land. Yeah, we need to see <laughs> the ship land otherwise how would we know that they landed and were there oh we need to see him walking up to it the atmosphere too. setting yep. how spooky is this Ooh. yeah it's building the vibe oh yeah oh, wow they're still walking checking they're my still watch walking. don't yep. even wear a watch and i'm checking it man. holy shit jesus <sighs> fucking christ man i get it you think you're so fucking cool imagine the scene began he not yet <laughs> not yet it began here. Yeah. <laughs> Why did it stop glowing, by the way? Did someone turn it off? Play I around guess? with it? Yeah, it ran out of battery. Is there a mechanism <laughs> in that? That's a stone. The, That's the a stone rock. It's magic stone, Rags. Better, I believe, we have located the reflex point on Cetos. What is it like that? The reflex point. What, did you know this was here? Is this what, the only reflex that's happening here? Is my you gag started, reflex? Started, what is a reflex? Oh, that's not a thing I know. Did you just mean? Did you just happen to find this right after you stole this? What? Give me no, the no, map. No, no, no. This is the map plan. Please no, talk to me. Maps. Please say something. Oh fuck! Does, oh. Dave, does Dave Filoni think oh. that people like looking 
like means something. You you need to have something about the characters. Toil or something. Like, and trouble. Shut toil up. and trouble. Toil and trouble. Oh, because the witches. Oh, oh the witches. God. How did you get down here? Oh, no, those, oh, these are the wild, wild ones. So, these are the wild I'm gonna put, I'm gonna put five whole around. American dollars on that scene is completely worthless because it's gonna be made worthless when we go back there to have the lady look at the map. Oh, you have the cringe yeah. shoes. How was Sabine yeah, able to? A... I don't know how Sabine didn't like die instantly from are this you, Sith. Is it false history reading right now? <laughs> this is fucking detective vision. What's you going on? You helmet out yeah, here in the rain and the elements. This means a lot if you've seen the other shows. Right? The space the, uh... needle. <laughs> no, no, she was no, just no. the events that happened last night. Why are the detectives. police not here doing an investigation? Yeah, she, Why? I don't, I don't know which is it. Hey, by the way, the commander was one of their citizens. Injured was attacked a very important by robots citizen. and sith the world is invested in expunging the sith what's Please the point something. of this what's the whole point of her walking He's in like this and looking at the cat? something useful here obviously yeah, but like it's going to take fucking ages they could have mm -hmm. just skipped to her being here and no. it's not going to take ages because she has to actually you know sort of ruffle through all of this equipment and everything it'll just be she'll walk around slowly and then she'll notice something and then she'll yeah. slowly pick it up and then she'll look for like 5 seconds and then it will cut back to oh, them 5 going seconds the wow that quick yeah. Yeah, by the way, we're already like seven and a half minutes into this episode. <laughs> Jesus The Christ. scene could have begun incredible? here. This could be the beginning of the, oh, okay, oh. So beginning of the scene. Oh, okay, so it wasn't even something that was hard to notice. Oh, right. <laughs> Let me hear this back. Let me listen to the same thing again. Oh my god, right. there's someone there's behind someone him. someone sneaking in. I didn't oh, realize there was going to be an action Wait, scene. Wait, what the fuck is he doing here? What? what? Oh, did you not see Why that? Why was he here? In? Oh, that looks pretty bad. Why are you smiling? I was hoping you were still here. Why was he still here? Why would it be? Why wouldn't it self-destruct? Oh, and it's gonna have the memories because yep. it's sore, yep. oh. and then they're gonna use it to fight. Holy no, shit! No, why you wouldn't it self-destruct? <laughs> Serial killers always return to the scene of the crime. <laughs> what are you doing? Why are you shouldn't fine? You, wait, wait, shouldn't She's you be supposed dead? to be healing. She's supposed to be dead. That's actually true. You're just sitting there She's so just casually. Fine. Don't you have other people in this galaxy so who much. have jobs? You think this might oh, hurt a bit ass. if you got run through with a laser sword? No, it's fine. Are you sure you're up to this? Like me, this kind of droid is incredibly resilient. Like me, this kind of droid is incredibly resilient. It's not really about- you have a hole in your, <laughs> in your <laughs> abdomen. It's okay, humans have plenty of holes. Seven from what I hear. Its memory core stays partially active even after termination. Well, that's uh, fucking that's retarded. Really it is, isn't it? You'd think you'd build it so that that wouldn't be the case. If you get the power levels right, you can recover the droid's memory. And find out where it came from. Finding out where it find came where from it doesn't tell you anything. Oh. This thing could have been bought hid. on like some store that sells droids. That, that wouldn't help you at all. And it should have self-destructed as you showed them Dude, doing. You, what happens if you get the power levels wrong? The head will explode. You can pull the plug before it gets to that. Wait, are we actually risking everyone blowing up? Yeah. I say go for it. Because you're a hologram. There's no time to relocate. No, take it out to the fields. Yeah. It's like a couple minutes away. Just no, go right. take we it out to the fields. No, we haven't got time field. enough to protect a whole fucking hospital. No, this is a hospital full of people We're who are very it, vulnerable. Sabine said, whatever, I can Think just of... not if a bad She's happen. cool. She's really cool. <laughs> We actually oh, doing is this. There a little, is there a little timer for when it blows? Oh, no, no, you're in a hospital. Blood. You're in a hospital in a city. Lord, if it blows, what is she doing? Right before she finds it, and it's like, oh god damn yeah. it! I would have had it. We're actually but gonna do it. Me. It's overheating. Switch Did you insane. like yeah, make a hole in the glass and? Yeah. So you look, and then they're gonna pull it right before. We are out of time. No, Stop just wait. I'm pulling the plug. Oh, wait. Ah, yes, see? Thank yep, you, Robot. Thank Good you, Robot, job, for robot. saving everyone. Thank Least you. predictable Star Wars sequence. Saving everyone's what lives. What an insanely dumb fucking sequence. This droid came here from Corellia. Oh, so they found it just that in time. That doesn't matter. Okay. Oh. It doesn't matter where the droid came from. That doesn't tell you anything. I guess it's something, but it's really not helpful at all. Morgan Elspeth had factories on Corellia. What if could, you actually took time? There could be a thousand reasons oh, for that. Oh, no, the Sith lady, the, the, the lady, she had a factory there. It wouldn't need to be active <laughs> for them to get a droid from there. <laughs> Imperial operation should have been dismantled after the rebellion. Anyone check on that? Well, why wouldn't they just take it to a laboratory with leaps. like experts and equipment to get every all the information they need? I will I'm completely fine. agree that this right. is what something, you you but fine. there's there's you're more. Fine. There's like a thousand different ways this could be explained in a very boring way that would get them nothing. Exactly. It's insane that they consider this such a good lead. You did good. Oh, fuck no, off. you are grossly no. irresponsible. This yeah. is a hospital. 
She got stabbed with a lightsaber last episode, everyone. Just so, we're, just, that's gonna give the so that we're clear. Throne. That's just, a just couple so of know. hours ago. Last night, she was stabbed through in the chest with a lightsaber. And now it's like, why is she even here? She's fine. You're both difficult. I always thought that made it work. Until it didn't. Huh. Well, that made happened. It work until it didn't. Still. You need to help each other. Oh, come on. Come on. Talk to people like You people. have a whole army of resources, and these clowns are the best you could do i'm glad and the first order blew up five planets why couldn't they blow up this one i'll get some rest you're gonna need it yeah probably for weeks and months and then rehabilitation also, you're probably under arrest for gross negligence yeah, you might actually and... actually you might die tomorrow oh yeah if, part if of anyone still found out what just happened in this room oh yeah Oh, we see? literally don't have any good characters. Uh, Why could we start here? Redundant. God, all that CG for no fucking reason at all. Show me what you found. Well, we found this little ball the, on the stone the, pillar. Put the ball on there. Also, please, maybe, the magic word. I'm actually blown away, yeah. What a waste of fucking time. This place was not built by the Jedi. It was built by the, by the way, um, Amish in a day. An ancient people from the good guys need to get galaxy. here right now. This is what An they're choosing. An ancient choosing. people from what a distant galaxy. Ooh, that's literally the Amish. Just to clarify, right? Good guys got to get here. Their leaders, a droid, was built on Corellia. Oh, no, Night Sister magic. The fuck? Is that like a necessary aspect of this contraption? It's cool, It floated bro. on its own before. But it floated on its own before. Yeah, you didn't. I thought it floats it's a piece of technology. It's a map, right? First it's time not you get a free magic. Float, we already saw time this. You get we already saw this. Why did you we need, need to, to use magic? Just look at the map like Sabine did. This is our galaxy. Oh, this is no, a map position. reading area, Rags. This will help us understand okay. the map. Ooh. Those finger movements An area designed specifically for map reading. Ooh. Oh my god! Oh boy. It's like Treasure Planet, but shitty. Uh. Oh. Well, the show certainly thinks this is impressive. Uh, I don't know what yeah. any of this means. I don't care. <laughs> Look, we gotta go here. Why did the map just say that? What's like, with all what the theatrics? This, what does this mean? That is our destination, while Grand Admiral Thrawn is banished. Grand yes, Admiral yeah. Thrawn was banished to another galaxy. <laughs> How banished? the fuck? Why was he banished? They would... Why would they banish him? Was it, it the, the Kangs? Did them, the Kangs right? do this? Pathway to Peridia. The children of the Jedi Temple call it that. It comes from old stories. Tales which are based on truths. Which doesn't tell us we... anything about... Is it because he got eaten by a space whale? That counts oh, as banishment? Exactly. Thrawn calls to me. Thrawn so calls Thrawn, to me. Is Thrawn force sensitive? Of course, I'm in space. space. If Thrawn oh, is no. magical, bro, they're fucking all of this up. Like, oh what's, shit. I am willing to believe because I haven't read *Heir to the Empire*, but I'm willing to believe that Thrawn That's didn't become cool because he was cool in universe. You know what I mean? Like, like a he super. He became cool because people liked him as a character. Yeah, like he would have made intelligent decisions. He would have been, yeah. you know, a useful person that made made things happen. Yeah. Not because like the whole you're just like this magic ball is making me sense Thrawn and he's been banished I mean, in other galaxies. I mean, it does speak to such a crazy, misguided understanding of storytelling, oh, doesn't wait, it? We got, a, we got a new thing, the Eye of Scion. The Eye of Scion is on its way here. Make sure that everything is ready for its rival. Darth Scion? Like KOTOR 2? Or... I, I don't know. Probably. They steal everything. What happens when we find Thrawn? For some, war. For others, a new beginning. I, guess. I suppose that's, that's vaguely a piece of characterization for this character that I know nothing about. And for us? Power, such as you've never dreamed. He wants power and a I new beginning. I have some crazy dreams. Go to Corellia. Assist Maroc with the final transport. See Corellia, so it, it will matter yeah. hugely that they go there and they'll be right on their trail yeah, thanks to it. That's couldn't right, just, they'll encounter be, each other. It would just be so funny if they trace the robot just some guy and it's his store and he's like, yeah, they bought a couple of droids. <laughs> oh, and just, yeah. you know, it's a planet, so it could be multiple places on this planet, but no, there's only one No, it'll be the exact place. place they check. Yeah. Why is there a map pointing to wherever the fuck the space whales took Thrawn and Ezra? <laughs> I don't know, man. The space <laughs> whales made the map, idiot. Oh, the city looks cool, though. Some people were really hard on the show with this <laughs> script. A lot of people in the CI, <laughs> the CGI dungeons slaved away. And not a single brick a inside. Show. I'm very happy. Oh my god, it's Guy. Guy from House. I am quite busy at the moment. I could make this a more formal inspection if you'd like. Why don't you just say it's really important and we'd like to request it? That won't be necessary, General. Please, this way. Uh... 
the hallway. So annoying because they're gonna find useful oh. shit. Hey, Is that a droid from Rebels? Yeah, that's Chopper. It's okay. really annoying. This was one of Morgan's facilities. Ah, look, oh, that's that's not a great yeah. blue screen. Yeah. She supplied raw materials used in the construction of hyperdrive generators for Imperial class star destroyers. Now we're taking them apart and using the cores to power the new ships in the defense fleet. Why not just repaint the star destroyers? Do the facilities still employ any of her former staff? Of course, there's no other way to remain operation. An empire doesn't just become a republic overnight. Why not just use the Star Destroyers as they are, put a new coat of paint on them, and... Yeah, they seem like, to be really effective. These are like factory workers, dude. Don't you worry about their loyalty? The average worker doesn't care about the nuances of galactic politics. Why would you be that naive? Why, so is the show like, no, they're not, they do care? I assume we're supposed to take him for his word, he's saying that... Workers don't give as much of a fuck who's in charge, they just want to make money. But I think it wants us to agree with Ahsoka and... We'll Wait see. Wait a second. I'll leave the politics up to you. Leave the politics up to her, but she's a general. Are we supposed to believe that the New Republic is... martial law? Mm. I really hope it doesn't turn out that one of them's just, you know... Well, yeah, because I was about to say, I was about to defend the show and say he's clearly making that point, but now you made me think, like, yeah, they're pro it's probably going to turn out the workers are um, Empire-affiliated or some bullshit, like in Mando. What are you getting at? Take your time, by the way, it's fine. I was wondering if you would consider bringing her back on as your apprentice. Um, like, she's shit. Do with you. Isn't that like a particularly personal question? I think she could use some structure. She could use a new stomach as well. She's not ready. What makes someone ready? That's a really complicated question. <laughs> you just know. You just know. <laughs> Oh, okay. okay. Never. I was wrong. Never, Never mind. mind. Disregard me. I don't yeah, even that's, know that's why that's I'm here. That's a really ridiculous and simplistic answer. How do you know when you're ready? Well, you do. Ah, oh, thanks. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, anyway, that scene was great. <laughs> oh, come on. And just like that. Wow, it's like someone just poked her with a cigar. And yeah. Just like that, fellas. Fuck off. If you want to have that happen, don't give her such a grievous wound. Just yeah. have her be shot or something, or have her be... I don't know. Have a pole go through her. Or it gets falls on rebar or something. I don't know. I see you still have your lightsaber. Ezra's lightsaber. True, he constructed it, and by all accounts, it served him well. Then he passed it on to you. Thanks, Thanks for the you. exposition. Thank you for letting us yeah. know that. Yes. You have since made your own modifications. She made modifications to make it better, probably. I can't train if Ahsoka doesn't want to teach me. Well, I mean, you can train on. Why would any? Yeah. yeah. I guess to some degree. Hey. She quit on me. Oh, can't imagine why. As far as you're aware, did this happen between shows? As far as I'm aware, yes, but you could have unlocked the I probably missed something. I remember she did some brief, like, Jedi-adjacent training. Isn't she already a Mando? Like, that was, like, with Kanan. Yeah, she's a Mando, but so tired of trying to How can you up. be a Mandalorian who's also a rebel commander, who's also a Jedi apprentice, who's also a... Is, have you noticed how, like, modern Star Wars likes to combo up Jedi and Mandos? Like, they, mm -hmm. they love it. This is like in Skyrim, where you can be the leader of the Mages Guild, and also the Thieves Guild, and also... Also the Dark Brotherhood, and also the Jarl of White Run, and all the other <laughs> bullshit. You just be everything, whatever. Yeah. Forgot how annoying you are. I think the show wants me to Doesn't like matter. Sabine. I think the show tells me is that lightsabers should be thrown in the garbage because they don't Thanks. do anything. Don't do any I fucking have, thing. I have known many Padawans over the centuries. You are the worst. Your aptitude for the Force would fall short of them all. So he's the best character. I won't waste any more of her time. And oh, mine. Oh, you got me because I want you to train. And... Flipped it on me. The only time you are wasting is your own. I mean, I guess you could still learn how to use a lightsaber and everything if you can't use the force, but... Or you I could sort of fall back on one of your 417 other talents. Also, he's yeah. probably still the best character, actually, genuinely speaking. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I mean, I don't even know who else would even qualify. I don't think there's any other characters present. This guy. <laughs> From here we keep track of the entire inventory being created. Oh no, Red should should we be in a hurry? is evil. Evil red C three PO. Oh, maybe that's where C three PO got the arm, well, the red arm. I mean, there will be a fight scene. Yeah, we oh, have yeah. for ages. Is that a hyperdrive core? Yes. <laughs> have you been paying attention? Refurbished from an SSD, ready for its new life. Superstar destroyer. Hey. This facility has produced nine of these new models. The New Republic Defense Fleet isn't building anything that big. Are you what? are you appraised of every single like ship in the that's galaxy? <laughs> Classified. I'm a general. Nothing's classified. That's not how that works. That's not how that works. That's not how that works. Fucking also, bullshit. it's classified at least to him. He can't open it. I cannot unseal the document without authorization. Well, then I'm authorizing it. That's not how no. that works. Well, I'm not sure you can. Want to bet? Oh my god. Oh, wow. What is this? I'm general. I have full control over I, everything that ever happens. Stop doing. 
whatever. Perhaps you can help with the protocol here? No, it's, it's classified. Well, I mean, he probably doesn't even have the capacity to unlock it. Oh, look, or, that guy's evil. Look at him, he's looking over. I think he's probably more like a security guy. He's look, like, he's got a you're not evil. allowed to do that. No HK class? Assassin droid. <laughs> Why would they have them? I should think not. I have seen such a droid. Why did you speak up? Oh no, they're all evil. Why? Where is this droid now? I believe it is departing on that transport. Oh, fuck off. Oh, wow. <laughs> we should be quick. Oh, if we quick. come on. Oh, wow. Stop that ship. I can't do that, General. They've been cleared for departure. Well, then unclear them. For the Empire! Oh, for the Empire! <laughs> <laughs> Oh wow, they're all evil! You can't. They all, wow, they're yeah, all kill evil. all those blue collar workers. <laughs> they're evil. What the fuck? They were all super empire. Oh, oh that was unnecessary. Oh, oh, oh that'd be hard on your knees. Oh, fuck, fuck, fuck. Look at her. Oh you man, I can't believe I couldn't outrun that spaceship. <laughs> Doesn't have much of a hero run there. I will glare at it. What, oh, how did you get here? They're just standing here. <laughs> they're like, hello, they knew we're that the you'd boss jump fight. out of the window? I can't believe this. If they if Wait, they were an hour on, later, they wouldn't have had any leads. Uh -huh. like, Are you standing there. to you the left? Wait, like, you gotta come to me, is okay? There, is there any reason why we've never seen any Jedi use like a dual sword strategy? It's only ever been her, right? Oh, is that a CGI yeah. cape? You couldn't just drop a like cape. Ayla Sakura she's like the had only two person who's never. Isn't she? Yeah, but, her, but she's doing the. She's got one that's short and one that's long, so it's kind of like the uh, samurai kind of I've combo. Never seen a Tanto lightsaber. Isn't that a helmet from Dragon Age Two? It does look like a from a fantasy game, doesn't it? As I just said, fucking Dark Souls. Dark Souls. Helmet. Right. Yeah. <laughs> like, yeah, I'm sure the fight against John Reveal will be really cool. Are you saying his name is John? What? His name's John Reveal. He's just <laughs> someone under there to be revealed. I repeat, CT05 return to port. Oh no! She's fucked. Is she fucked. a yeah, really good pilot? Or is no, she... wait, you're in a, yeah, you're in a thick as fuck, slow as shit okay. transport ship. How are they not annihilating you? The first because thing you have to do miss. is take a, evasive a really maneuvers and stay Also, up. somehow those lasers explode mid-air. I don't know how that happens. Why are they making, like, flak blasts? Yeah, that's like, what I was trying to say. Lightsabers and, well, but the and thing is, air cannons are useless. I was about to say, if she gets a flak blast, like, there's no way she's avoiding all of them. Okay. I mean, nothing's gonna happen yet. It's too early. It's weird that he doesn't have anything on his. Oh no! <laughs> now I'll win. Please <laughs> <laughs> do. No, but I'll do a double them. damage, baby. <laughs> oh, this is so exciting. Look at her. She's Look weaving her up. left and right. God, she's just suck. going back and forth. Look at how, it's how so are you, boring. How are you missing? You can't just shoot it down. It would crash into the port city. You are so calm. <laughs> Just ready a tracking device. Can't shoot it down because it'll crash in the cities. Like, the, but, so what's the plan exactly? Yeah. Why are you not trying to get out of its range? He's gonna get a tracking thing on it. Uh, isn't it That's worth contacting supposed. the authorities contact of this planet? Do, do authorities I mean, on yeah. planets just not exist? No, there's only our ragtag group of misfit heroes. Because th they probably have the what's, technology what's to happening? bring this ship down safely. Probably. What do you, you think they would? Off? No, I did not go through your stuff. Oh, oh, oh. Oh. Yeah, whatever's happening here. Oh, oh, oh. Great, now hurry up. They're gonna make the jump into hyperspace as soon as they clear the atmosphere. They're still... Uh, they're still shooting. They've shooting at it for like an hour. They should yeah, be whoa, out of atmosphere already. Oh, I gotta go, I gotta alert like on my... Oh, oh fly no. away, fly! <laughs> do the flying. Oh, come on, please. Oh, oh, do the, the cringe, come on. Fly away? Why don't you throw the lightsaber at him? Wow! wow. Uh, are you trying to me? kill the both of them? Whoa, that was Wait, weird. Wait, keep shooting. Keep shooting. Yeah, keep shooting. Keep shooting. Well, the lightsaber is gonna come back now. Oh! <laughs> oh, that, so cool. that could easily have killed you. Wow. If it was, was aimed the other way, you would have died. No, she no, knew she because knew. of the force. Oh, That's fuck right. Off, man. So he was there just to There's fight. Still, so a still shooting. How are you missing so much? That is insane. <laughs> this is the most That's the same. Dude, the guy who's was. shooting that turret is probably like, I hope nobody finds out about <laughs> Wait, this. What do you? Are you actually? Oh, he has to actually throw the fucking. You, thing. What? You, what? What do you That's, mean? No, you can't shoot. Okay. And they're just like, why didn't she shoot at us? That was weird. Oh, she might have put a tracking. How thing is she on alive? Her. How? What do they think how? she was doing? Just following them, and then oh. she was gonna like, you know, why wouldn't they assume? that she put a tracking thing on there, especially the with that maneuver. I mean, the four cannons that were unloading on her mm -hmm. all the way up to space, and she's just like, 
What's the point? What's the fucking point of guns? Why are they there? Oh, first the off, why yeah. does a ship like that even have fucking cannons in the first place? <laughs> yeah. It was a transport, but two, yeah. How could you shoot for that long and do nothing? And fuck you. Oh, she's back. Great. She's back. Back to get her on. How, how long Time to watch another there. person, yeah. So, predicting it would be the end of the season was bold. It's actually only like two episodes in. I just can't believe she's just fine. Dun, like, dun, this took, like, dun, no dun, time dun, at all. Dun, dun. It's as if nothing happened. Yeah. Oh, yeah, Mando Armor. Oh, my God, <laughs> look, Kusi Armor. Oh, it's a... Why oh, does wow. look shitty? It's so small, like... We need to spend so it much looks time so on this. Tiny. This is epic and cool and awesome. How come soldiers just don't, like, have armor in this universe? It's the Jedi like, know it got. Yeah, there it is. Well, you're not part of the club anymore because you took it off, so fuck off. No, she's not part of that That's group. a weird club that no one likes. What are you bringing to the helm? On her small anvil. Uh huh. We gotta fill God. hardcore here. The episode wants to oh. end, but it knows it card. What are you doing? No, not the palm. Your... Okay, okay. Not the... gonna cut off the hair. Yeah. Oh no, but her hair is so with awesome and thing? cool. Like I cut my long hair with a knife just because it works, but you want a bigger? Like I don't know. If... From watching too many samurai films. Why is it taking Jesus so Christ. long? <laughs> it's ritualistic, fringy. You this is very care. important right. for no, her. No, 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 no. It's not. It's not bundled up what, evenly. What should be it's perfectly gonna be, styled? If... What should be perfectly styled? No, this it's going to be perfect. unequal on the sides. You have to let it down over your shoulders no, no, no. equally, and then make sure that it's uh, level. No. Oh no! Oh, it's going to look shitty and uneven. No, I can tell by the way. It's going to be no, perfectly it's... styled. Oh. Oh, okay, fair enough. It won't even matter because you're obviously going to wear some sort of a space arming cap underneath your helmet. Wait, why is it's that guy getting arrested? Why is he arrested? Oh, I guess he was evil. Okay, he didn't seem evil. Okay. But I don't know what he did. Just work in this place, trying to you know remain operational. Why These would people the... trying to be paid? How dare yeah. they? Why would they turn to the Empire if the New Republic's so good? And how come Ahsoka doesn't have eyebrows? Don't need him. Ugh. I'm ready. Wow, you are cringe, Mando. Jedi, she's even got a lightsaber. Fuck off. I've. Um, oh, it's it's really like I want my all my OCs together. Yes, it's and he actually got paid to do it. And who is the coolest character in the show so far? The awkwardly walking droid man. Hey, wait for me. I need my. Oh. No, she got here on her own. That's I funny. know, but I was making a joke. But your joke, it, it joke defies wasn't the good, laws of reality. This is a mom. Oh look, it's the mural. The mural. What's what's the deal with the two doggos? What's the uh, deal? <laughs> Spirit doggos, you know? Oh, oh cool. okay. Nobody seems to care about Kanan, who also died. Oh, I guess they're not important to this story, are they? Even though, like, he, he had a kid with Hera, by the way. She has a kid. Oh, oh really? She has yeah. a kid? How far away was that? Yes. How long? And also, and also, apparently, humans and Twi'leks can interbreed. Uh, yeah. Okay. Who drew that? A 12 year old? <laughs> Did Dave Filoni draw that? <laughs> hey. <laughs> Nice haircut. Liar. Liar! Are girls allowed to have long hair anymore? No. The transport was traced to the Denab system. Yeah, of course. Of course, this great lead is going to give us everything we need. Sure, because that's how it works. In, in well, the, it's just a good thing the that they, they figured not to remove any tracking beacon that might have been mm -hmm. on their ship, which Man, was a likely outcome shit. of that shit. Remember it, how... Oh, that armor looks really cheap. They only yeah. got, it's yeah. just like a cheap jacket that they've glued, like, plastic to. It doesn't couldn't look like got, armor. Couldn't they have just gotten one from the extras from Mando or something? where they had like Even those didn't they, look good, but they look yeah, better. Yeah, they were better than this. <laughs> Hang on this shot for as long as you can. For as long as yeah. you can. I can't believe all of this came from her going back to Sabine's house and the robot was still there. Take us out. Padawan. Oh, oh wow. Oh, that's again. the payoff for that? That's just done now? Wow, I remember that she was stabbed last episode. <laughs> wow. Yeah. I don't even care wow, about wow. these characters, but wow, what a waste. I mean, two episodes in and it's already over. The last time <laughs> it was discussed was this, the halfway through this episode, was like, oh, well, it takes yeah. a lot, you know, the two people, blah, blah, just like Padawan lol. Oh, that's what, what you what need are we to here? for. Oh, is this the Eye of Sion? Uh, this, will be, this will be their interstellar, no, yeah. intergalactic traveling ship. This shit's just been here. Fortunately, like, this has been the last one. They needed so no problem. Why, why is it a floopy hologram? Yeah, they don't I don't do know. It like that. Soon the Eye of Scion will be complete. The appearance of Ahsoka Tano on Corellia troubles you. Yeah, Jedi hunting us is troubling, I guess. It does. We made a clean escape. She could have tracked us here. She could have tracked, tracked us here. Why don't we check? Why don't we fucking check? What do you see? Have a think about it. 
Our presence in the force is elusive. So is the good writing. And her determination is vivid. She's coming. She's determined. Uh, That's a really cool trait. To kill her would be a shame. There are so few Jedi left. Are there though? I'm so oh, tired of I'd, every yeah. single character like in the fucking universe talking up Ahsoka. Yeah. Every <laughs> single fucking character she ever meets. Well, I guess I'll get my Remington 870 and kill her. That was 38 minutes. This shit fucking sucks, dude. Yeah, it's sure. really, it's terrible. Oh, it's terrible. Off, yeah. Dave. It's Chris. just like the others, except more cringe. Yeah, I think this one is more cringe. Yeah, this one's aware of it's how, like, you know, it, it really it thinks it's cool. There's just, I've, I've just got, like, nothing to work with or care about. I mean, I kind of yeah. like the robot, uh, Hu Yang. Uh, he's all right, I suppose, but... That's like it. I hate Sabine. I don't have anything to work with with Ahsoka. She's just in the same it's kind of mud pit as stupid really as everyone anywhere. else. We've seen this much of Ahsoka and it's genuinely like, what is her character? I'd be like, um... We've had an hour and a half, basically, oh, of this fuck. show now. Well, and including I don't know stuff from the other shows. I, I don't know who I don't, she is. Other than, oh, well, I guess you didn't want what's-her-name as a Padawan, but now it's chill. That's about well, it. She's also got a history with Anakin. And the New Republic can spare yeah. no resources to help them out. It's just the three of them going on their adventure. Even though it Even... seems to entail the return of this Grand Admiral Thrawn, super duper important What's guy. What's he gonna do? He's, He's a blue man. Know. It is. It is so <laughs> funny. <laughs> they treat him like the arrival of fucking Galactus, and it's like yeah, he's just yeah. a guy. Like, He's a guy. He, he is a smart guy. He has no fucking resources or anything to work with. What's he going to do? Yeah. They once Rommel like... runs out of tanks, what's he gonna do? It's so yeah. funny. Yeah. You with like, his they, pistol. They find him, and he's like, "I was abandoned here by space whales. <laughs> Help me! I live here in this hut that I built from hut goo." Is the Thrawn planet the gold one? Oh, that's probably, yeah, probably. That's probably where they're going. So you see, it's foreshadowing in the opening credits. Ain't that clever? This is these I mean, they, big ass pauses all the time. Just like, what are we? What is happening? No, what it just wastes your time. It really it's does waste your time. time. It feels like what we achieved there in what was that? Like forty minutes could have probably been achieved in like ten. 15, yeah. maybe. Well, and it's you know? built on fucking sticks, man. All of us so easily ready to fall apart. Like, they turn mm -hmm. up, what's their lead? Well, the spooky, strange robot mm -hmm. man tried to kill us was built here. And, like, who knows what that means? That could mean absolutely anything. Reprogramming is possible. They could have turned up and they said, yeah, yeah, they bought it from here. We didn't think anything of them. Oh, okay. Now what? It's so lucky that the ship, it was leaving just as they got there. Because like you said, if it was an hour later, that uh, just would have been it. No leads, nothing. They'd be they'd be screwed. It'd just be a dead end. And it's all based on what? Because the droid was still there. And then they chopped it up. And then it was going to self-destruct. But it still had a partial memory that they could use to figure out where it came from. How thin is that? Well, remember, they went to the command center place to just talk. Mm -hmm. That's where she saw the big hyperdrive. And then she was able to ask, like, wait, we wouldn't have any ships that are big enough to accommodate something like that. Which is not a reason to be suspicious of a space part, by the way. That could mean anything. Not in and of itself. No. Yeah. And then and then he's like, oh, well, it's classified. That she's like, that, like, Dave Filoni was probably proud of himself for being like, <laughs> this will be funny. I'm a general, bro. Uh, that's as high as it gets. Nothing's classified. Mm -hmm me and it's like what <laughs> sure, there is no such thing works. as compartmentalization in the military nor is there a, like yeah. classified to just the highest degree where nobody's able to access whatever that was anymore as information necessary like there's so many different ways that can work and it makes you think like she's an idiot like there's no good mm. reason why anything would be classified from me person who must think very highly of themselves when it comes to the dealings of the Republic on all formats everywhere of all time. Does she, do you get a sense from her that she's like a hugely important leader? It's like, not really. No, it was like a pilot, like, like a random pilot. Did. She started out as a random pilot. I guess they forgot that she's I, Oh, is that one now. of her other incredible talents? <laughs> you just don't get the yeah, sense yeah at all from her that, uh, and, and you'd think that she may have pulled together a team for this mission at this point, because it sounds pretty important, but no, she is going on these missions with Ahsoka. It just doesn't come across as like a military operation. It is just like a handful of people in disparate places with disparate roles sort of coming together to like explore something that could have massive implications yeah. for the galaxy. Well, this, this, anybody oh, anybody can show vibe as rebels in that way. You, why haven't they contacted Luke yet? Yeah, uh, yeah that's right, because he oh, is... Shit. Yeah, yeah, you're right, the, know, Sith, the, the Sith are coming back, yeah, Luke. Oh, Empire Shit, remnants who are trying Luke, to sabotage Leia, us as we chase Han. Sith, who are trying to get to Thrawn to reignite the Empire. I feel like you should Akbar, tell them about this. Mon oh, yeah. Mothma, like all these people is, that you can call. This is arguably the biggest fight that's happening in relation to the Empire Republic might, remnants. It also might be mm -hmm. worth give Mando a call as well. <laughs> See if the Mandos are available to yeah. help out. You I, know? Just, I just think that if you told Luke about any of this, he'd be like, holy fuck, this is insane. We've got to... Uh, crazy. Yeah. Why didn't you tell me about this sooner? 
I'm around. Yeah, no, you, I'm you, around. you went to yeah. the Republic. You've got your tentacle friend and your weird immune to lightsaber friend, but you won't have me. Also, I guess nobody's gonna give a shit that a commander just fucking left the planet to do a little adventure. She with nearly someone. got well. She should have died. She was shot at about a thousand times. But I hate how didn't get a scratch. Shows. Yeah, it's, it's, it's but it's so easy to write. It. It's like fake oh, danger. We need fake danger to yeah. simulate. It's simulated excitement. That's what that's it just, is. It's just simulated just excitement. Slowed around they, a little bit. They can get away with cutting back to that same same evasive maneuver over and over and over again, yeah. like six fucking you know times. What? I'm gonna mm. I'm gonna make a comparison and praise the prequels. Here I go. Ahsoka yeah. starts fighting two people with lightsabers, right? And it's kind of like. We all felt the whole like nothing. We knew that she was gonna be fine. Nobody ever fucking dies. Even if she was had her head chopped off, it fucking back to tank would solve it. Blah blah blah. As she's doing that, Green Lady's leaving, and she looks over at her. She sees her fighting with lightsabers, and she's like, nah. And to me, it's just like, do you remember in Phantom Menace where Obi Wan is locked away and he has to watch Qui Gon and Darth Maul fighting, and he looks stressed mm -hmm. the fuck out? Because you know, at any moment, one wrong move and you're dead. They're like sweating and it's exhausting. I don't know why that's on my mind. The whole getting stabbed in the fucking belly and actually yeah, but, dying. But now it's just, I guess, whatever the plot wants to happen happens, I guess. And you like, there's no sense of connection to what you're actually watching. It's like you're on a ride in. Like, yeah, it's it's like ever, it's whatever fate wants to happen is what happens, I guess, you know? It's just a really hollow spectacle. I just, I... Yeah. It, I just, it doesn't I really matter. Do hate <laughs> all the connecting pieces, nobody gives a shit. Nobody ever gives a it shit. It doesn't seem like we care about that, which is a shame because the connective tissue is what makes it, like... Well, that's the show. What makes it. Yeah. It is the is story, the ultimately. Yeah. That's the story, yeah. That's the story of your story that you're telling me. It'd be so just... funny if she was like, oh, he was on a transport, actually. Which one? Oh, the one that left four days ago. So, rip. Oh, man, and these <laughs> shows really aren't made to be rewatched, are they? Could you imagine, like, sitting down to watch these episodes again and just having to sit there for ages as characters are just walking? Not really emoting. We never really get to focus on, like, how they feel about the things that they're seeing. Just, like, walking, walking, put the thing in there. Oh, look, it's doing the thing. It's making noises, everything. It only really works if you buy into this, like, mystery and, oh, what are the reveals going to be as we go by week after week and I get to talk about it on Twitter. But, like, afterward, I can't imagine watching this show like a second time and feeling like enthralled by it throughout you know enthralled i was thinking that but that's opportunity came and went it's unfortunately just, mm -hmm. yeah it is rough watching this shit and yes what do you guys would you take a bet that you'll never ever in your entire lives ever watch something like mandalorian season two ever again it's like yeah probably uh, no way no way i they, they, i don't think these shows are made to be watched again they're made for the optimal consumption to be on a week by week basis as they're coming out so that you can talk about it on the internet which is funny because um, if they made them good they would actually achieve their goals much more than they realize. Yeah, exactly. Because if it's good, people will talk about it week by week with people on the internet or in their social circles and things like that. But they also might be inclined to watch it again. There was but, a viral uh, tweet that said uh, event TV is dead. And it was referencing, um, it was a moment in Game of Thrones season seven, funnily enough, where a dragon gets speared and it dies. And it was shocking and everybody shared. But funnily enough, it's part of an episode that was awful. Out of a season that was pretty awful and just the idea that like yeah the the almost internet's water cooler right discussion where a big thing happens and we all go nuts over it they've like murdered it because this obsession with because there will be reveals in this season of course there's going to be like oh look because mm -hmm. the, the, the episode where anakin shows up everyone's going to be obsessing over and posting pictures and stuff but the substance is what keeps those moments alive for at least a little bit longer because it's just nobody talks about the shows anymore after they're done you know, give it a week or two and it's it's over. It's done. It's like the, the show has served its purpose. The film, if we're talking about like Marvel films or whatever, have served their purpose of getting people through the door, getting them to go to the cinema or getting them to maintain the Disney Plus subscription. And that's like, that's it. It doesn't endure as like a creation like all the films in these series did. People rewatch the OT. Who's going to rewatch the show when it's done? I just, I don't. Why would you? I don't see that happening. Yeah. What are you going to discover? What What is there to enjoy? What, is it just like lightsabers being wiggled around because the fight scene well, right? we're going to they're obviously going to kill um one of the evil people possibly all of them I don't know if they'd kill any of the three main ladies in there. Probably not. Ahsoka's never gonna die. She'll become a god. No, 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 dies. she'll be around yeah, forever. <laughs> main um, character of Star Wars. And I was just thinking to myself, like, uh, what is the most effective, barring Andor, we're not gonna consider, Andor's not Star Wars, okay? What, what's, the, <laughs> what's the most effective <laughs> Disney <laughs> Star Wars death scene for all of the characters they've killed since uh, Force Awakens? 
Uh, I, don't know. I, I have a name, but I was going to see if anyone. Else. So you're saying what's the most impactful? Yeah, like substantive, impactful, meaningful death scene or death in general. I mean, it might be Han. Yeah, is it Han? Not what I'm Probably. going with. To be fair, it's a technicality uh, that you might not agree because of the nature of it. But I was going to go oh. with K2SO. Uh, oh yeah, yeah, that's <laughs> oh. right. I was sad. Uh. I was actually sad when he died. I wasn't. I wasn't either uh. bored or outraged. I remember that feeling of noting that like one of the most effective things they did was with the fucking robot and then being like shit we're this far along and it's still that <laughs> like, ex yeah. except for Andor which again just doesn't Rogue One Andor fits in with Disney Star Wars a lot more than Andor does oh, Andor wow. is kind of the uh, the thing that we were trying to talking about was like have a real show and then give it a Star Wars paint job that's all if by the end of this show the general sentiment is is negative what what do you do you think anything changes <laughs> in terms of the way that they make things well so obviously we go by precedent nothing has changed for a like, significantly long time except like We've had changes in creators. And, and the thing is, we hit gold with one of them. And it's like, so what? Is mm -hmm. it just like a dice game at that point? It's like, pretty much, I think. I guess so. Like, mm -hmm. maybe. Um, maybe The overall okay. nature and investment in artistic sort of integrity at Disney is pathetic. It's one of the worst in history. So you're not going to be able to... There's no, like, rising tide of artistic integrity that gets us a baseline that's pretty strong. That just doesn't exist well, there. Well, I don't know if they can even aptly diagnose their problems. Yeah, like, phase one of Marvel, and even, like, phase two and three, like, it felt as though there was at least the understanding you got to get the baseline character yeah, protagonist yeah. an arc. As long as we got that, yep. we'll work with everything else and build it out, and, you know, things can go wrong, things can go right, but we at least had an identifiable main character who has something to learn. If we can just do that, We'll be okay. But like Star Wars doesn't have anything like that. I have a character who fucking gets stabbed, and that's real sad. But then doesn't die. What's the point of even having them get stabbed? We didn't even talk about how they baited her death because we never took it that way. We were no, like, she's gonna death. be fine. Yeah, like, no, obviously no, that's what that's for. It's to make us all go. <gasps> But she like, was fine as insanely quickly. Yeah. Like she was like she got stabbed with a lightsaber in the next episode. She's already off having adventures. It's like why yeah. why fucking bother? What's the point of having her get hurt? Like seriously, what is the point? What does it solve? What's the narrative purpose of it? Why not have Ahsoka get closer? Oh no, I've gotta leave, or else Ahsoka's gonna get me. And the evil Sith just runs away. Is it so that two cringe lords gets to have their lightsaber fight at the end? <laughs> it's funny. And it's, it's like, just... see, it's me again. Ahsoka I'm the OC. versus uh, Maroc, apparently is his name. The the two great examples of the different direction you can take cringe what's like, Marat? i mean I, I know the name from the episode but i don't know who that is no we don't, I don't we don't know who he is yet we're gonna find out oh, i'm mystery sure cringe, lightsaber yeah. man but just the he's all in black and like a knight yeah it's like doesn't yeah, he's speak cool. it's like how is ahsoka then it's like well just ahsoka just lame because the the fucking writer's intentions are she's just stoic boring cringe i am cool yeah, she's got i the same... insist on it She's kind of like the Mortal Kombat main guy. Just She's boring. got like hero protagonist oh. syndrome. She's just lame. Because yeah. I know that a lot of people be like, well, but she wasn't that lame in the show. And it's like, okay, but like, <laughs> I guess I'm just talking about this then. Because she, I thought she was lame in, uh, in Mando and Boba Fett as well. She was just this She's plank really bland. of boring cringe. Because remember, um... her introduction in Mando was enough for them to be like, ain't that fucking cool? Look, they're in live action. Awesome. Yeah. Great show. Fantastic. 10 out of 10. Can't wait to see more. Ba -dum -ba -dum -ba -dum. Oh, I I like um, yeah, yeah, goodbye, everybody. Around. We'll see, see you again Bye. next time for episode three. It gets good. Bye bye. Later. It gets better. Voice. What'd you bring me?